As the baby boomer generation moves into its golden years, home builders are ramping up so-called active adult communities. One big name in luxury living is leading the pack. Toll Brothers is banking on big returns from boomers who don't want to cut any corners. Diana Olick reports tonight from Broomfield, Colorado. Jeff and Sharon K. Brown are not retired yet, but they moved into this active adult community just outside Denver less than a year ago. It was a good way to get involved in things. But they didn't want to skimp on any amenities, so they chose a new home built by Toll Brothers, a national luxury brand. Because this is it. You know, this is the last house you're going to have. you got to get what you want. And that's what Toll is playing to in this community and in one just going up in nearby Aurora, Colorado. Gourmet kitchens, open floor plans. How about when your exercise room walls open up to the great outdoors? They don't want to simplify necessarily, they want to right size. And a lot of them are coming from three and 4,000 square foot family houses. And they're downsizing in square footage, but they still want the luxury. They still want the house to live big, fit their needs. Home prices here can run over a million dollars, but demand, according to Toll, is only growing. The company has had strong sales in active adult in the Northeast and Midwest. And on a recent earnings call, the CEO said Toll is now expanding the adult brand out west, quote, in a big way which means going even bigger on the lifestyle options, bigger and better clubhouses. A full staff coordinates everything from lectures to entertainment, games and competitions, full gyms, indoor and outdoor pools, Five, six, seven, eight. even line dancing if you like, but it doesn't come cheap. We've been fortunate, we've both worked for 30 plus years and been able to save and invest and all that stuff. So we, we have funds accumulated to get here. And for as long as they're active, they intend to stay here. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Diana Olick in Broomfield, Colorado.